In Nigeria, about 70% of the population pays out of pocket to access services. This means that without money in hand, it is almost impossible to access life-saving quality healthcare. As part of its social investment program, the Shell Petroleum Development Company of Nigeria Limited, SPDC, and NNPC and other joint venture partners have supported health initiatives to bridge service gaps in the health sector. This includes technical support which led to the birth of a sustainable community health insurance scheme model at Obio Cottage Hospital. Leaders of four Shell industrial area cluster communities around Obio Cottage Hospital were eager to make a difference in the lives of their people. This led to the adoption of the Community Health Insurance Scheme as a means of improving community health. SPDC and its joint venture partners and the Shell Industrial Area Cluster Communities signed a Memorandum of Understanding to pilot this scheme at one of the 20 SPDC JV supported facilities. In 2010, a community health insurance model was launched at Obio Cottage Hospital using Public-Private People Partnership Model, PPPP. This PPPP model had the government of River State as the public regulator monitoring the process for quality and equity. SVDC and its joint venture partners provided the private sector support with technical and financial assistance. The four communities of Shell IA Cluster, who are the people, provided ownership and Obio Cottage Hospital was the healthcare provider. With this model, the community members consistently pay a premium to access quality healthcare. The community health insurance scheme model at OBO has made quality assured health services accessible, affordable, acceptable and sustainable to the people of OBO and its environs. This government-owned hospital has grown to be financially independent and its CHIS model has run uninterrupted for over 10 years. This model has demonstrated that a public-private people partnership can lead to quality service provision and improved health of the people. Through the community health insurance model, the Obio Cottage Hospital moved from attending to an average of 600 patients a month to an average of 7,000 a month and recorded increased monthly child delivery from 2 to over 280. Mother-to-child transmission of HIV was prevented in 99% of babies through an innovative PMTCT program at Obio Cottage Hospital. Obio Cottage Hospital provides quality healthcare under one roof, maternal and child health, immunization and infant support services, HIV AIDS and TB support services. This model also runs a co-payment plan for specialized services like hypertension, eye care, and cancer care. Since 2010, the Community Health Insurance Scheme has enrolled over 65,000 clients cumulatively with an average of 750 clients enrolled monthly. One reason for the high influx of enrollees is the availability of a wide range of affordable and quality care services, courteous staff, and an excellent client relations program. For example, with health insurance, a cesarean section may cost as low as 10,000 naira, that's approximately $21, as opposed to an increase by 20 to 25 folds in other facilities not operating health insurance schemes. The cost difference alone could mean life or death. The CHIS model at OBO is one that is possible to replicate. Key elements to have include a well-defined community, beneficiaries, an existing hospital, people, public-private partnership and a reasonable pot of money. Success is on the journey, shall we? In phase one, extensive stakeholders consultation sessions across different levels took place. This included advocacy visits to leaders, community engagement and sensitizations. 
Generating evidence was a key component of this phase to determine willingness to pay for health insurance among the community. All this sets the scene for common understanding among partners and buy-in of the communities. Phase 2 focused on upgrading the physical structure with necessary equipment, essential utilities like green energy and water were also provided. A more efficient facility management system was put in place. At Phase 3, the PPPP partners worked to define the basic minimum package of care for the scheme. Health maintenance organizations were engaged to act as intermediary between the client and the health facility. To kickstart the scheme, a premium was paid for 4,000 community members who were able to benefit from the scheme for one whole year. A few things to know as you embark on this exciting journey. First, you must continuously invest in community mobilization and sensitization. You should set up a feedback mechanism to deal with complaints and issue resolution. Make staff learning and growth a priority. An example is the Obio Cottage Hospital staff exchange learning across facilities, volunteering system and the Shell sabbatical training program which improved skills, satisfaction and work attitude. Next, have a well-structured quality improvement program. The OVO experience was patient-centered and care-focused and deployed performance-based financing. Establish a system of financial accountability. To accomplish this, the scheme adopted the Community Health Insurance Enrollment and Authentication System. You must build sustainability from inception using the 5C plus M concept. And finally, and most importantly, tell everybody, replicate this scheme and don't forget to say you learned this from the OBO Community Health Insurance Scheme. Thank you.